it's Kelly and I'm wanting to go ahead and talk about the TMS device and how things have changed and improved for me in the last week since I've owned it. I can't believe well, I haven't owned it, I'm renting, for the weeks that it's, it's been in my possession. So I'm really excited to show you all. Of course, this is the bag. I don't remember if I showed you, but it's um, neoprene and it's actually really great. Look at it and inside there's a pocket for the adapter over here and it fits really snugly and it's actually waterproof which is really important <laughs> for this device so um you know i've shown you all about the device i'm gonna put up a uh, video if i haven't already about what the screen actually looks like when i turn it on so and start it so i'm gonna turn it on and i'm gonna start charging it up here once it gets on let's press the treatment button Okay, so I learned a lot of things about the the Spring TMS that I didn't know initially, and I'm really excited to share it with you. And I think that the things I was showing you in the very first um, video where I put the device up and everything, it was my very first time. <laughs> so I wasn't exactly sure about what I was to do. So I wanna just remind you that when I do this treatment, I have to take off all metal that's on me and taking off my glasses too it's important and so any jewelry metal up um, and I have to be a good two feet away from anybody with a beating heart including my dogs and also uh, you know no metal like cell phones or anything so that's two feet away from me so I'm gonna go ahead and here are those little buttons I'm gonna show you to the side basically it's gonna cradle the back part of my head and I'm gonna put my head down and deliver the treatment. So that big thump was something that at first I thought was going to be, it says treatment complete, and then I press the button to start again for another pulse. So uh, basically that thump I thought was gonna be really, really horrible for when I have um, migraines and actually I thought it was gonna be horrible all the time, but it isn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Really, once you're doing it every day, because I'm using it every day for prevention, it's off label, it's not FDA approved yet in the United States. And uh, I'm also using it for um, aborting migraines. I have migraine without aura, so that's also off label, but um, hopefully, I know they're doing a, a study now for um, prevention, and we're hoping that this will help me off-label for aborting my um, migraines without aura. So here is my second pulse in my aborting. So again, I'm gonna place it at the, where it cradles my head, I'm gonna tuck my head, and deliver. So what it feels like, it feels like, it sounds really loud, it feels like somebody's going, just flick in the back of my head. It really sounds a lot louder than it even sounds to me. When I watch it back on video, I can't believe how loud it is. Uh, so I feel I feel something. I don't feel what I said in that very first video was I said, I feel like electrical things went right through my head. I don't get that anymore. Um, it was just those few first few times. I'm not really sure why I had that, but um, I did. So, oops, I forgot to hit the treatment start. So basically, uh, for per for prevention, I will use four pulses in the morning, and then I'll use four pulses in the evening. Now that's by prescription, so that's not me giving you advice or anything. That's just basically what my doctors told me. Make sure you stick to what your doctor does. This is a doctor, this is by prescription, so you, you wouldn't wanna do it like, it's kinda like medication. You know, if I said I was taking 200 milligrams a day of a medication, you wouldn't go ahead and do that too. Uh, you would wanna talk to your doctor. So um, basically what it is is that, like I said, four in the day and four in the evening, and then or in the morning and the evening. And then if I, like now, am wanting to stop a migraine in process or abort a migraine, then I can do three pulses every 15 minutes up to a certain amount of pulses that will kind of total for the day. So um, right now I'm gonna be doing that third and last pulse, but I'm hoping, the reason I'm turning to the side is because I want you to see what it looks like and where the angle is and where I'm placing it uh, because it was kind of dark uh, in that first video and I think I'm watching it because I turned off the beep there is a beep on there I turned it off because it freaks my dog out so I have to watch the screen and it tells me to position the device which I'm gonna I told you okay so again so I'll show you what it looks like front so your elbows will be in like this or my elbows are and where my thumbs are is the trigger and head down 
and there we go. It really is not as bad as I thought. And I actually video myself when doing it for the first, well, actually up until today, because I wanted to make sure, not that I'm being, it's because I wanna make sure I was doing it correctly. And actually I found that as the days were going on, I had gotten a little lazy and I was, I was actually doing this thing. I was kind of letting the hands out and I wasn't really making sure I was in the correct placement. So I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off because um, though, you know, and it does, have a charge it only um it only stays charged when it's completely charged it will you know you can use 18 pulses and then you have to recharge it so i haven't had to recharge it since uh yesterday so it's been a good day well actually as far as the migraine treatment goes i can't really say one way or the other whether or not it's truly helping me i think that there's a couple reasons for that First of all, I'm still learning it. Uh, my uh, RN, which is the uh, educational consultant from eNeura that wants to help me for the first three months in making sure answering my questions, uh, I have not actually con connected with her. We kind of miss each other, um, but I'm gonna go ahead and email her. And uh, so yeah, that sh talking to her I think will help me in making sure I'm doing everything right, including the placement. And I think because I didn't exactly have the placement where I thought I did, or maybe it should have been, um, perhaps I wasn't getting as good a results. Um, as far as prevention goes, it probably will be like any migraine preventative that you would take orally by mouth. Um, you know, it would take a few months, probably like up to three months, my doctor's saying, to see if it works. So I'm hoping I do keep, there is a diary online, um, but I haven't, I need to get access to that with my RN too. So I've been keeping, you know, a diary in addition to, I know most people keep a headache diary. Um, I did for many, 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 many years. And uh, it was, it was a great tool for me, but I stopped because things kind of stabilized, even though they weren't in a great place they kind of were keeping steady and I found that my health diary was making me focus more on how sick I was as a pair compared to actually living my life and so excuse me I don't know why I have this indigestion so um yeah it, I think that you know it's really great to be getting back and to see you know okay how what is what is my headache like and I don't know what the diary that they expect is going to be like but I'll, I'll update that you know on you on that and I'll also update you on how it's going uh, like I said right now it's kind of up in the air I'm still having a lot of hope um, of course I don't know and I and I don't know what's gonna happen you know in the next three months so or you know six months I'm just really excited and still very hopeful and um, I think that it's something that I'm trying not to put too much hope in because um, it's kind of one of those things whenever you start a new treatment you know it's like I've had so many treatments not work for me and to have this not work for me again would be, you know, kind of hard. Um, well, really hard. <laughs> Let's just be honest. Um, you know, and it, it's really so expensive that I would want to make sure that it's really helpful. And uh, I think I would feel really bummed out if I tried it and then for as much as I did, um, basically the first payment was $500 including the $50 shipping so it's, it, they say it's a discount which I'm sure it is um, and on like what the yearly uh, rental fee will be but it is quite expensive and I'm hoping that what will happen is that it will start um, being so helpful that my insurance company will start covering it and actually my insurance company does cover it however I have a um, it covers up to 80% of the cost right now out of pocket so I we have a high deductible and so because we had not been filing um, my um, headache specialist does not file for um, insurance so everything there is out of pocket since I haven't been filing there um, you know with the claims with the uh, headache specialist you know I'm kind of for the year you know behind on that but I think what we're going to start doing is filing that and seeing if we can build up to that um, number and see if we I don't think that we're meeting it I think we're, it's so high that we won't but um, 
you know, maybe we will and this will cover part of it because it is a significant amount of money. So um, anyway, I hope that this has been helpful for you. Please ask any questions that you might have or might not. It just, I just wanted to show you what it looks like for me. Um, so many people have different experiences and I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm just another patient. So I'm just giving you the information that I have based on my experience, based on what my headache specialist tells me. There's a lot of information out there that you can go and read up on the TMS and the spring TMS and how it is used for migraines. Um, I just want you to know how I'm doing with it. So there you go. And I hope that you all are doing as well as possible and that today is a good day for you. And just remember to hold on to hope. I have to press the button. I forgot. <laughs>